now this is one of the uh, little advanced question which i must say uh, there is a very obvious question if it is asked about the cranial nerve 5 but if you see the options are not given here so if you see here the cranial nerve related to apex of the petrous temporal bone now here the keyword is the petrous temporal bone and you can see the options 9th 7th 8th and 6th are there right 9th 8th 7th and 6th but you don't see option uh, the trigeminal nerve is not there in the option so actually the petrous temporal bone is related to two cranial nerve cranial nerve number 5 and cranial nerve number 6 now this cranial nerve number 6 okay it is the abducent nerve and it arises at the lower border of the pons okay so i'll just uh, give you a brief view of this so this is your pons okay and this particular nerve that is your nerve number 6 that is your abducent nerve it arises from the lower border of the pons right and it is generally seen opposite to the pyramidal medulla okay so opposite to the pyramid of the medulla it will be found and it will be passing through a canal that is known as the dorelos canal now this can be an important thing right this will be passing through the canal that is called as the dorelos canal and this dorelos canal is formed by the apex of the petrous temporal bone and there is a ligament also involved in this that is known as petroclinoid ligament so if you see this particular thing this is the apex of the petrous part of the temporal bone that will be forming the dorelos canal through which your abducent now passes and it goes inside the cavernous sinus and then it will be going to supply the lateral rectus muscle of the eye right so this is the course here which should be very uh, well understood by this particular uh, explanation itself so if we go quickly to the key concept the nerves related to the apex of petrous temporal bone fifth is one of the obvious answer and the sixth cranial nerve now this sixth cranial nerve generally passes through now here they have discussed about the fifth one right so six i have already discussed and this is the sixth one this is the petrous temporal bone and here you can see the trigeminal ganglion at the sensory root of the trigeminal ganglion okay so this is the fifth cranial now fifth cranial now right so if we go back to the question we can easily answer this the cranial now related to the apex of the petrous temporal bone is going to be six that is abducent nerve and the trigeminal nerve which is fifth but here the option four is going to be the correct answer